Okay, guys, I wanted to jump back on right, right quick and share with you guys some of the items that I will be putting in my mom's wine, cheese, and chocolate basket for her birthday tomorrow. I'm not going to show you the finished product because I can see now I'm going to have to do some maneuvering and it's going to take me some time. But I did want to come back on and share with you guys some of the items that I will be putting in this basket and maybe it will give you guys some ideas if you decide to make a cheese and wine basket. And you can, and this video is basically basically going to show you that you can get some of your items from a variety of places. I purchased the baskets from the Dollar Tree. Some of the food items will be from Jewel Osco. Jewel Osco. Some of the items, the food items, will be from the Dollar Tree, my favorite place. And some of the other food items will be from Marshalls. And so, yeah, I'm going to show you guys just some of the items that will be going in this basket because I'm going to put everything in these baskets. I know I'm going to have to tape some stuff down and prop some stuff up. But, yeah, these are the two baskets that I purchased from the Dollar Tree. And I'm really leaning toward this one because I think it's cute. But yeah, and I may even save this basket and make my mother-in-law a Christmas basket as well. I'm not sure, but this is the one that I'm going to attempt to use for my mom's birthday gift for tomorrow. So yeah, I'm going to sh just show you guys some of the food items. What, yeah, some of the um, items that I'm going to put in the basket. They're not just food items, but just I'm just going to show you guys what I'm using. Starting out with these are some candles that I purchased from the Dollar Tree and this is the cranberry and this is the blueberry These are my favorite jar candles from Dollar Tree outside of the I think it's the pumpkin scent Something like that. But yeah, these are my favorites though. This is the blueberry and this is the cranberry So since it's that time of the year, my mom is a Christmas baby. I am going to add those to her basket this picture frame, this silver 5x7 frame is from Dollar Tree. This will be going into her basket with my son's picture. And once again, the two pair of furry socks will be going in there so that she can wear those with her onesie. These are the crackers, the gourmet crackers that I purchased from Dollar Tree, Monet Original Entertainer crackers. Those are going. The peppermint bark and the wine stopper. Okay. These were the items. Okay, wait a minute. A couple more items from the Dollar Tree. I'm, I'm trying to show you guys all the items that I purchased, purchased from the Dollar Tree first. And this is just this just shows you that you can get some gourmet items from the Dollar Tree. You just have to keep your eye open. You have to know what to look for and read the ingredients check that expiration date and yeah you can find some great items at the dollar tree to work in your everyday life as gifts things that you use in your home we all know that which is why we do dollar tree hauls which is why we love doing dollar tree hauls so yeah i'm going to add the two cheeses that i purchased from there by silver slate and this one is the white cheddar cheese with mediterranean herbs and this one is also by silver slate brand and this is the pepper jack cheese the Purulene Cream Filled Dark Chocolate um, Wafers. You guys know about this. This is going in there. And the last items from the Dollar Tree are the two coloring books. These are going into her wine, cheese, and chocolate basket. Okay, these are the items that I purchased from Marshalls that will be going into her haul. And I try to keep everything budget friendly um, that's how I live my life. You know, some things you have to spend more money on because you want it to last. And then some things, you know, you can cut up, you can cut a few corners. So I purchased her the Ghirardelli chocolates. I purchased four of them. This one is the Ghirardelli, um, square 60% dark chocolate, rich and velvety. And these were two seventy nine. That's chocolate. Number one, that's going into her basket. The Ghirardelli Squares Dark Mint Chocolate. She's going to love these. Also $2.79. These will be going in her basket. 
Ghirardelli Squares Dark Chocolate Sea Salt with Caramel. Mm, tasty. $2.79 going into her bag. And the last chocolate will be the Dark Chocolate Caramel. Okay. I purchased all of these. Excuse me, guys. My hair is just so flat. My hair is really flat by the time I get home to um, make these videos for you guys. So, excuse me. They, my curls were popping earlier. So, yeah. But anyway, I know it's not about my hair. But in the last item from Marshalls would be the stuffed with blue cheese olives. And these are by Stella. And this is another gourmet item. And I've seen these in Jewel. So yeah, 8.29 ounces. My mom loves olives. So yeah, this is a product of Spain. These will be going into her basket. I'm going to fit this. Stuff. This stuff is going in this basket, y'all. One way or another. Okay, and then this item, don't tell her, but I won this at work playing bingo. Okay, don't, don't tell her that I didn't pay for this. I won this. And this is the room to room cool stuff for your space. Extra large wine glass and this holds a full bottle of wine she won't be drinking a full bottle of wine well i don't think she will but yeah so i should take it because I'm, I'm gonna have to take it out the box so let me this would be we would be checking out this glass for the first time together because i didn't take it out the box but i'm gonna have to take it out the box to get it into her basket so cute right so this holds a full glass of wine. So this will be going into her basket. Now, if for lastly, guys, these are the last items that are going into her basket. I think I got everything. Guys, I just remembered in that Dollar Tree haul that I just did for you guys, I left out my um my wrapping paper. So I'm going to include it next week for you guys, okay? I'm going to make sure you guys see that. So I purchased a bottle of the Sweet Red Blend by Barefoot. So I can only fit one bottle of wine. I would have purchased two. So yeah, I'm gonna put this one in her basket, the Sweet Red. This is the only red wine so far that I like. Red wine is really strong for me, but this one has more of a sweetness. So yeah, I like this one for myself. And I purchased her I wanted to get more of those. Um, they have some of the brie cheeses that are shaped that have the um, that have the Eiffel Tower on them. That are that did cost more, and but I I felt like I could get more. I wasn't being cheap or anything. But I saw that these were the also these were brie cheeses as well, and these were buy one get one free. So guys, don't judge me. But I just wanted to get her get more cheese. So this one is more of a spread. And this is um I can't pronounce this, but it's by Alouette. I think I hope I'm saying it right. So these were buy one, get one free. And so this is a brie cheese. Um I wanted to get the other cheese, but it was eight like nine ninety nine for just it was similar to this. It was it was it was shaped in a triangle. I'm, I'm quite sure you you guys that love cheese know know about brie and how it's packaged. So I I went with this one. So I think she's gonna like it. She's a she's a cheese fanatic anyway. So I purchased that and I purchased some of the Bridgeford sausage to go in there so that she can have the meat cheese in the sausage. So yeah, I'm gonna situate this. All of these items in her basket, and um, so yeah, guys. Um, I I won't have the finished product for you guys right now, but I just oh, I just wanted to hop back on to show you what I was going to put in my mom's basket, and maybe it can you know give you guys some ideas, and maybe you can put one together for your loved one. So that's basically it, guys. So I'm gonna let you get back to your Friday and relaxing and yeah that's about it and i will see you guys in the next video don't forget to rate comment and subscribe and see you guys later